is going on in our real estate market now as we are into March of 2021. Now, before we get started, please don't forget, hit that button, ring the bell, and make sure that you are subscribed so you never miss one of our awesome and informative video uploads. Hi, everybody. I'm Tara Coyle with Coyle & Roberti Real Estate and eXp Realty. Well, guess what? This market is not slowing down. In fact, it continues to remain stronger than ever. So here is our latest market update as of the close of February 2021, reported by Trend Vision for our greater Sacramento, California area. Well, we saw a 19.4% increase in average home prices from this time period last year in February of 2020. And we're now sitting at an average home price of $561,000. We also saw a 50% decrease in average days on market from this same time period last year in 2020, and we're now sitting at an average days on market of just 22 days. This is down 22 days from the same time period last year in February 2020. But what's really important now is that pending home sales are still up. They're now up 3.5% year over year. And what this means is that people are out, they're shopping for homes, and people are still selling their homes. And according to the latest report released for our area, hot homes continue to sell for about 3% above list price, and they're going pending in less than five days. Most homes are getting multiple offers, oftentimes with waived contingencies to make them more attractive. Now, according to the Sacramento Association of Realtors, the number of local homes, condos, and townhomes sold in February was 1,516 a 1.3% increase from the same time period last year, and there are now 1,049 homes for sale in our region. However, and this is what's really important, is the amount of homes available in the Valley remains low as demand continues to outpace supply. There's still less than one month supply of homes for sale, where a six month supply is considered a balanced market. And in fact, we now have 0.7 months of inventory, which is slightly more than we had in January, just one month prior, but it's 57% less than we had the same time period last year in February of 2020. The interest rates, they're still historically low. They're hovering in the high twos and low threes, which means that money is cheap and it is an amazing time to purchase or to refinance. Now, as always, we hope that you found this video to be beneficial. We're happy to help anybody needing our services. So please comment, post, or share and make it a great home buying and selling day.